As you can see, I'm teaching. When I'm teaching, you're seeing me here, down there at the bottom right side. And my PowerPoint is at my back. Okay. And I'm doing this by using OBS Studio. And this OBS Studio is free. Okay. So I'm going to uh, give you the link uh, for you to download. Don't worry. I'm going to also give you the link step by step how to do this on your computer. Okay. And also step by step how to do this, the PowerPoint. So I give you both the PowerPoint and I give you the video. Okay. So I'm going to show you the link. Okay. For the OBS project, you can just uh, Google, sorry, for the OBS studio, you can just Google OBS studio. They will bring you to the link obsproject.com. It is free. Okay. It is free. I personally only discovered this due to PKP. So because of the PKP, I had to stream all the lectures online. I was asked by the faculty to stream all our CPC. CPC stands for Clinical Pathological Conferences every Wednesday. We had one this morning uh, about uh, stomach cancer. Okay, and I'm supposed to... Uh, okay, this one, Razina Sharif is asking, boleh record slot ni? Uh, this thing is recorded. You can get it from my YouTube. My YouTube is simple. YouTube.com slash Dr. Tamer. Okay. My YouTube. My, okay. Uh, that's the nice thing about having my name. Azmi bin Muhammad Tamer. Anak Tamer tapi orang Melayu. So, the, because of that name, I, everything I put Dr. Tamer. So, you search, search for YouTube.com slash Dr. Tamer. You get this video. Okay. So, uh, OBSproject.com. That's one. To get the PDF file. Okay. To get the PDF file. It is at tinyurl slash stream zoom to uh, stream zoom okay? stream zoom tinyurl.com stream zoom for the video it is at tinyurl.com slash stream zoom to so the video is there but i just checked the video i just realized that it is very noisy because that one it was recorded on my old asus net notebook something wrong with the audio cable so it was very very noisy so i'm very sorry about that Okay, so hopefully this one will be better. Okay, so okay. So when you saw the obvious video, it looks something like this. Don't worry, they even cater for Windows, Mac OS, and also for Linux. Linux, they have for most of the major flavors. But the only one that they don't support is uh, Raspberry Pi. Uh, I'm also a Raspberry Pi fanatic. I've been trying for about two weeks, trying to get uh, OBS Studio to run on my Raspberry Pi. Uh, there's this pie you cannot eat. Eh? This pie, if you cannot eat, uh, I cannot get it to run. Okay, so you can use it on Windows, Mac, or Linux. Okay, so you just I'm not going to show you a demo on how to install OBS Studio. Uh, it'll be an insult to everybody's intelligence. I know everybody knows how to install a program, so you just install it and follow all the instru instructions until it is done. Okay, okay. So that's the story about OBS Studio. I think you noticed just now when I was uh, when we started, I had that scrolling text. I had that scrolling text. Okay, I'm going to show you again the scrolling text. Okay, uh, okay. I know people complain, Dr. Azmi, suddenly you become very dark. Okay, my background is very dark because of the because of uh, the green screen technique. Okay, but you can see down there at the bottom, down there at the bottom. We have the scrolling text and we have the UKM logo. So whenever I'm teaching my class, I will always have this thing running so that they know uh, my name is so and so. That they have my link for my all my notes and they have the link to contact me by email. Uh, I have the UKM logo. Uh, of course, I have to be proud of UKM. They are paying my salary. Okay, so this is uh, the scrolling text. I think you saw this every evening at 6 o'clock when you're watching Tansri, uh, Tansri Shah Abdullah, when he is uh, giving the, the number of COVID every evening. So you can so also have the same thing. You want, you can put also the result of the COVID down there slowly. Okay, so I'm going to change back to the green screen. Okay. All right, so now I'm back to the zoom screen. Okay, so you can see that. So I'm going to show you 
how easy it is to do this on your on your uh, on your zoom or on your teams it is so easy that i only have to show it to my students only once and based on what i showed them last week they they ran the what we call muasram muasram is a students uh, medical conference and they run, they run it totally on obs studio and they did a fantastic job okay but of course uh, the young the young are different we are old already the young you show them only once they they go crazy with it okay uh, so i'm going to show you a video eh? uh, please take note i'm going to stream a video when this video is streaming okay you're not going to see as any uh, any differences like what usually you saw last time last time whenever people stream a video you see that thing is jagging up and down okay so this one i'm going to show you streaming using obs studio is going to go very very smooth so for the next five minutes i'm going to show you how easy it is to customize your video feed and then later i'm going to show you how to share your zoom okay i'm going to go and play back that video now okay i'm going to demonstrate on how to create a new scene so that we have all the layers there okay we're going to start on the left side you can see here on the left side there was the word scene i'm going to create okay so the, since this one is the demonstration i'm just going to put the word demo click ok so since this is a demo we start with a blank slate and there's nothing there so the first thing we have to add is our video source so on the sources we click right click we click sources so we click the video capture device since i already have my sources already uh, determined uh, so we're going, to, we're going to select my webcam there so click ok my webcam so when we have the webcam here first thing we do is going to resize it okay now we have the uh, the webcam now we want to create the layer the layer is the, the scrolling for the background for the scrolling text so we're going to add the media so right click image so we want to put an image there so what image are we going to put we are going to put in the background the scroll text for me uh, if we want to add a new one okay so i'm going to put demo new one okay new bg so i'm going to create a new one so where to get the new one we are going to get it from the media file so where whichever you wherever you put it so you have to take note where you put the media file so for me is i put it on the obi studio folder so for me the background here it looks like this okay there's a the background i click ok now the background has already been displayed here at the top I just pull it down okay so now you can see that I have the background so after we have the background next thing we want to put is the scrolling text so we want to put the scrolling text so we right click here we put what you want we want to have the text okay so this one is a demo so I'm going to create a new demo so the name is scroll text demo Okay, I click OK. Okay, so now what do you want to have, to have demo? So I'm going to type in the word. This is a demonstration. Okay, <laughs> demonstration. Of a scrolling text. So you can put anything that you want there. How, how many words I put in up to 2000 plus words it works okay you can even get it to read from a file that's the easier one okay so to separate this one from the starting point so I just put the the, the, the that thing there okay next you want to reset the size okay you can select the font we have so many fonts here we have aria we have andale agency up to you whichever you want to okay? so which one is the most suitable size Based on my experience, 3248 is nice, 36 is nice. Okay, click OK. So we have the size there. Okay, once done, click on OK. So you have the, the word there. This is demonstration of a scrolling text. So now you have to 
get it to fill up the whole area okay this one is not nice not, not long enough so let's make it uh, much longer okay so scrolling text demo so I'm going to copy and paste this one again and again okay click OK okay so now we have this scrolling text okay. so you can see this is quite long this is quite long it does not matter because they will scroll accordingly okay so you can resize it as we can see that we have reset just nice okay now we're going to get this thing to move how to get this thing to move right click filters so under defect filters we right click on scroll okay so click scroll and now we can set the speed so the speed we have horizontal speed we have vertical speed so in this scenario we are going to go for horizontal speed we're going to put a 32 okay click close you can see that it's quite fast okay so this is a scrolling text now it's moving so after you have done that the only thing left is to put in the logo so for the logo is right click again you put in as a midget image so what is the image you're going to put in a logo so again it's because this is a demo i'm just going to show you demo logo okay click ok so and then i will look for the file so the file is here okay we have so many logos here so this is my favorite okay that's it. once done you click ok now you have the logo there big size now you just uh, it's a matter of resizing it so that it fits okay so and with that we are finished okay uh, thank you very much okay okay so what i did is now was to show you how to create a scrolling text and how to share it on your zoom or on your teams i'm going to have a powerpoint on that eh? i'm going to have a powerpoint on that so don't worry okay so this one is the gray color 1920 times 70 pixel this one the logo you came you saw already in action just now okay this one is the playback which does not does not work haha <laughs> okay so inside zoom i think you can see here clearly yeah you can see inside here clearly okay there's the button there when you click on the video you can change that fit to whichever camera you got right now i got four cameras sorry i got three cameras plus obs studio okay so i got four feet there so i can select any of the four feet to show whatever that i want okay so that is the the trick under zoom if we are doing this inside teams same thing inside team same thing so inside teams you just change on the uh, for the camera you just change for from the webcam to become obs camera and then you get to see uh, your your face come out on the screen but please stay note under teams teams tak mirror teams they tak mirror so they everything they will look terbalik so even your name will come out terbalik so don't panic your, your friend will see it correctly uh, okay so that is how we do it inside OBS Studio for Teams and Zoom.